boy welcome back i'm in my garage right now I'm trying to do a little cleaning here and there garage is a little messy right now but for this video if you can't tell from the title what we're going to focus on is that that right there is messier than all this garage stuff right now let me show y'all real quick see this mess right here i gotta deal with all my sockets and stuff everywhere my wrenches and ratchet look at this look at this it is, this is, this is, look, it's just stuff everywhere. It's crazy. Of course, I'm a little OCD. So I'm gonna try to fix it up and make it look better. We're gonna or organize the tool chest, but on a budget. I'm not trying to spend a lot of money on this. There's uh, foam cutouts out there pre-cut already, but they're very expensive. But what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna try to do something on my own. I'm gonna use this. Foam fatigue mat. I'm gonna buy, it's from Harbor Freight. It's about a four, four, four piece. I'm about $10. It's a almost perfect size to my tool chest that I have. I cut it out. We're gonna make outlines of the tools and we're gonna put them in, make it organized, so you know where it needs to be, and what's missing, stuff like that. Now, my tool chest is a US General. It's basically a brand from Harbor Freight. It was, it does the job for now. I didn't want to get a bigger one because I didn't know how much space I have in the beginning. About five doors, you know, two small ones, and then two big ones, and then this long one right here. And you have the top cover, and you have storage in the bottom. We're gonna upgrade to something better, you know, when you work on cars, you have, you're really missing tools here and there, you know, especially your 10 mil. But I'm about to change that. We're gonna upgrade with this Husky 230 piece, brand new from Home Depot. It says value for 4.95, but I got it for a hundo, $100. Using this thinner red foam mat. I'm gonna put this on the bottom so you can see the outline. Got these from Michaels for a dollar each plus coupon, so I only pay like five something. Not too bad. It's just thin enough for it to show color, but not too much. Hopefully, this video is gonna be short. I'm gonna try to make it short. Nice and simple, cheap, alternate. If you get a tool chest, to make it organized, look better, you better work on your cars. Let's go. The important thing I've done in this garage. AC. Ah, best investment ever. Time to open the stuff. Try to unbox this tool chest. F. I'll be right back. It'll work. Yeah. Let's go. Oh. Don't have scissor right now. Like I said, it'll work. Moment of truth. 230 piece Husky tool set. Oh wow, that was a fail. Gonna have to redo that. Again, moment of truth. Ah, oh sh snap, almost broke it. Sure. Trays here. Look at that, nice and neat. I didn't see anything before. Of course, you got all your sockets. You know, one half, your three eighths, one four, your standing ones. You know, typical stuff. Nothing too crazy. But I got to put figure out all this layout into that. So I made my first, I guess, cut or piece from a drawer. Didn't record it because I was doing a test trial. Didn't want to look goofy. But let me show y'all real quick. This is what it looks like. This 
what it looks like with stuff in it. I can do this one hand while recording. Bam! What's up, fam? You can probably tell already. New clothes. It's the next day. I had to do something yesterday, so I couldn't finish. But while I went ahead and did this part, I didn't want to record it because it was going to be forever. It takes forever. Plan and cut my socket drawer. This is all the socket. It's going to be in one drawer to the phone. Kind of drew it out, lay it out how I want it, cut it out. I didn't want to record it because it's about, uh, I would say like 130 rectangle I had to cut out, so it was going to take forever. But this is the final result. Now, is it perfect? No, but I don't care. But this is how it's going to look once I put this in. Try to do this one-handed. Boom. Tell, tell me that's that's not nice. Tell me that's not nice. Watch, watch this, watch this. See this right here? Let me go put that up. Oof. Oof. Come on. Come on. That's nice. I had the uh, socket laid out up top. Of course, it's not going to be standing. It'll be laid flat, but this is... I have... SI on one side, metric on one side, so it'd be nice and clean and neat and organized. So we're gonna fast forward to me putting everything in right here in three, two, one, go. Woo! Tell me that's not beautiful now. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Nice in its own place. Doesn't move nothing. Look at that. Yo, if you think this is really nice and beautiful, put the fire emoji in the comment below. Let's go. Tell me that's not. Oh God, I can't, I can't. I can't get over this. From this box itself, all I have is the three ratchets and then the wrenches and a screwdriver, I guess, handle and then the heads. Which shouldn't, shouldn't be too bad. These, well, the rest wouldn't be too bad. So they're big pieces. And there's not a lot of them, like the socket over there. But next, I'm probably going to work on... socket here and don't mind this part because I have a lot more tools that I have that I don't know where it is I got to find out and I don't want to cut this and rearrange and all that stuff before I want to make sure that I have what uh, whatever I want here that's why it's empty but I know for sure I want these you know, breaker bar so nothing too crazy cheap take some time I know this video is nothing really crazy but you know it's just it's a mod that I'm doing and for anyone anybody who's interested of course you know here's the video like I said I'm just trying to make a quick video out of this but than that thank you for checking another video of mine please like comment subscribe and y'all have a good day deuces